Well, this weekend is going to be a picture perfect weekend with temperatures getting into the 80s today. Lots of sunshine and we are going to continue this beautiful stretch of weather for quite a while as we head into the rest of the weekend and into much of next week as strong high pressure remains in place and in control of our weather. So looking at your 24, we pretty much will going to be dealing with fully sunny, sunny skies. No cloud cover pretty much as well. Temperatures getting into the upper 70s to around 80 by the time we head into the afternoon and pretty much full clear skies as we head into the day today through the overnight and into tomorrow. Temperatures will be falling down into the lower 50s and upper 40s. So a cool start tomorrow, but temperatures are going to rebound pretty quickly tomorrow with those with that full sunshine and it will in fact actually be a couple of degrees warmer tomorrow than it will be today. Today, though, we are still expecting to see temperatures getting into the upper 70s to around 80 degrees. Currently across the area, we're looking at about 46 degrees right now in Springfield. Winds are calm. Looking at the Monarch Place sky cam towards West Springfield, we're looking at pretty much all blue sky. So just a beautiful time right now and any outdoor plans that you have today, tomorrow or on Memorial Day, you're going to be just fine as we do have lots of sunshine and warm weather on tap. Temperatures across the area, 46 in Springfield, 40, uh, 52 right now in Hartford, 56 right now in New Haven and into the upper 50s as we head into the eastern part of the state. Satellite and radar, really not a lot to look at right now as there is pretty much all blue sky across the area. And in fact, as we widen our view out a little bit more, you can see the sunshine continues heading into the Ohio River Valley, the Great Lakes states, and down into the Midwest as strong high pressure really dominates our weather. Now you can see here in the Carolinas, there is a little bit of some weather happening here, and this is a tropical disturbance right now. And this uh, is this area of low pressure is actually going to be suppressed by the high pressure that's in place right now across New England. So we are going to be staying dry due to the high pressure that we have in place. So taking a look at the future cast, we are going to be looking at pretty much sunny skies as we head through the rest of the day today, as well as during the day on Sunday and into Monday as well. Breezes are going to be coming in out of the south on Monday, and then we are going to be ushering in a little bit more of some warmer air. So that's why temperatures are going to be just a few degrees warmer on Sunday. But then as we head into Monday, we're watching a backdoor cold front, which could come through coming from east to west, and that looks like we could also see winds shifting out of the east, and it could be a little bit breezy on Monday, and that could just knock our temperatures down a couple of degrees, but we have no moisture associated with it, so it still is going to be a beautiful day on Monday. It will just be a little bit breezy, and temperatures are going to be in the upper 70s to around 80 degrees. So while it will be a couple of degrees cooler than on Sunday, still above normal, because you got to keep in mind our average high for this time of year is about 74 degrees. So taking a look at the surface map, here's what we have going on right now. We have the strong area of high pressure. Here's our tropical system around the Carolinas, bringing in some rain showers across portions of North and South Carolina, as well as the Mid-Atlantic region. As we head into the rest of the weekend, high pressure is going to continue to dominate. Uh, circulation around high pressure is clockwise. So as we head into Sunday, breezes will be coming in out of the south and southwest. And then as we head into the day on Monday, that's when we're going to be looking at this backdoor cold front come through and breezes could be coming in out of the east. So that's just going to be something that we're going to be dealing with. But again, the wet weather is going to be staying off to our south and we are on tap for a beautiful stretch of weather. In fact, the Climate Prediction Center places New England on pretty much right around where we should be for this time of year in terms of precipitation. This takes us through late next week and into the following week, June 3rd to the 9th. And in terms of temperature, once we get through the warmer weather this week, we could actually start trending a little bit closer to normal or even a couple of degrees below normal as we head into uh, next week and in the following week after that. But in the short term, we are looking at temperatures running a bit above normal. Temperatures are going to be getting into the lower to middle 80s for the next couple of days through Memorial Day weekend. And then as we head into next week, we could be taking a run at the 90s. So we are going to be looking at a bit of a summer preview heading into Thursday and Friday of next week. But then beyond that, that's when we can start to see those temperatures trending just a little bit cooler than uh, normal for this time of year. So taking a look at the extended forecast, really no rain in sight for at least the next seven days. And then as we head into Thursday and Friday, we'll see those temperatures getting up into the upper 80s to around 90 degrees. We do run the risk for a few showers and thunderstorms as we head into the day on Friday. And then we start to trend cooler as we head into next weekend. 